viewers can you tell me what skill distinguishes a man from the animals and birds there are several but most distinguishable is ability to use weapons and tools tool using has been essential since man's evolution you will be amazed to learn that researchers show that even animals and birds use tools for their survival Welcome to its Tomorrow News. I am Hena Talati. Researchers often see tool use as a mark of intelligence. Originally, it was thought to be a skill possessed only by humans, as some tools used requires a sophisticated level of the mental action or the process of acquiring knowledge and understanding through thought, experience, and senses. The tool used by the species other than man is a phenomenon. in which they use any kind of tools to achieve goals such as acquiring food and water grooming defense communication recreation or construction humans birds primates and other mammals are all known to use them and now a report by british and australian researchers published in the journal current biology says that the octopus is an invertebrate can be added to this Several species of fish also use tools to hunt and crack open shellfish. Extract food from that is out of reach or clear an area for nesting. Today in this episode we will understand the use of the tools among cephalopods and few birds. Cephalopod means head foot in Greek, a reference to the way the cephalopod's head connects to its many arms. A unique example of the cephalopod is octopus. Octopuses are known to utilize tools relatively frequently such as gathering coconut shells to create a shelter or using rocks to create barriers. Australian scientists have discovered that an octopus collects coconut shells for shelter, an unusually sophisticated behavior. that researchers believe is the first evidence of tool use in an invertebrate animals it was observed by the scientists that the octopuses selected hard coconut shells from the sea floor emptied them carried them under their bodies up to 65 feet and assembled two shells to make a spherical hiding spot often octopuses use foreign objects as shelter and prepare shells They even carry that objects over long distances and reassemble them as shelters or tools used. This incredible activity has never been recorded in invertebrates before. It was observed that most of the octopus collected shells for later use which is more unusual. The fact that the shell is carried for future use rather than as part as a specific task differentiates this behavior from other examples of object manipulation by octopuses. This particular finding of octopuses is significant as they reveal just how capable the creatures are of complex behavior. The soft-bodied octopuses spreads itself over the stacked upright coconut shell. makes its eight arms rigid and raises the whole gathering to then stroll across the sea pole the amazing thing is a fundamental difference between the picking up a nearby object and putting it over your head if we talk about octopuses they have always stood out as a, appearing to be a particularly intelligent invertebrates and they have a fairly well developed sense of vision and they have a fairly intelligent brain Now let's have a glance at the tool using skills in birds. Charles Darwin was the first to observe this tool user birds on the Galapagos Islands in 1835. He observed this skill in woodpecker finch. The woodpecker finch has a typical short finch like tongue rather than a elongated woodpecker tongue designed to penetrate deep surfaces or long burrows with the help of this the woodpecker withdraws gobs and other food items to compensate 
अ वुड पैकर फिंच ब्रेक्स ऑफ अ कैक्टर स्पाइन और स्मॉल ट्विक इट होल्ड्स इट इन इट्स बिल एंड प्रोब्स अ कैविटी स्क्रैपिंग द इंसेक्ट लावे इन द ओपनिंग वेर इट्स बिल कैन रिच Researchers found that one such bird was seen with a 6 inch cactus spine which was too long for the job amazing isn't it a similar tool is used by the new caledonian crow on the pacific island of the new caledonia wild woodpecker finches simply snap of a cactus spine at the desired length new caledonian crows make twigs by bending them to form a hooks or make serrated rakes from the stiff leaves in the research experiment researchers found the crows with two different pieces of wire one straight and one hooked whenever needed the bird would bend the wire to form a hook and promptly retrieve the food carrion crows of japan would drop walnuts on the roadways and wait for them to be smashed by the cars driving over them in fact crows were observed lined up with the pedestrians at a traffic light when the light changed people walked across the street and the crows hopped out to drop their walnuts and then hopped back to the sidewalk waiting for the light to change and after another light change they would go back out and extract seeds from the broken nuts perhaps the most amazing use of the tool for catching prey comes from the australia in the stories and traditional ceremonies aboriginal australians in the northern part of the country have long referred to birds carrying fire recently ornithologists published accounts of the witnesses who seem to verify the legends saying birds of the prey use smoldering branches of the spread fires and scare prey from the safe cover black kites whistling kites and brown falcons are known to hunt small prey at the edges of the bush fires so we have learned that when intelligent animals or birds use tools they often do so in very creative ways We hope you would have found this interesting. If you want more ideas like this, let us know in the comment section below. Write to us for further queries. Till then, like, share and subscribe our channel.